Yo, what up, everyone? Yo, what up, YouTube? This is Damnation. Today, we got a box from Survival Box. <laughs> Gear only, because I don't need food or anything like that. But, uh, I got this box as a filler box, just to try it out. Um, I seen somebody else have this box, and, you know, I thought it was pretty good, so I'm getting it. Or, I got it, and, you know, now we're here. Um, the reason why this is a filler box, and I'll let you know at the end of the video. Let's see what we got here. <clears throat> got a cool little three ring binder with some survival stuff on it. Card one. Bear camping requirements. That's cool. So you don't get eaten by a bear. Let's not get eaten by a bear. Let's see. Zero flashlight has been discontinued by the manufacturer. No longer available. Well, I don't know what that is. Alright, so we got the gear. So we got the handbook, which is that. Figuring binder there, I'm guessing. A SOG or SOG traction folding knife. A Mac V tool. 550. Five, oh, 550. Paracord, three feet, Hank. That's probably the color. Goal Zero Solo Solar Flashlight. <coughs> Live Fire Survival Kit. Tactical Molly Rucksack. Insta Fire Eco Friendly Fire Starter Cree 2000 LM Tactical Flashlight Zeus AA Batteries Molly Carb Carabiner Snap D Ring Clip Two of them So I'm guessing they're going to be like the uh, ones that we got in the Spec Ops Spec Ops Global Box But those weren't D Rings Well, Carabiner's the I'm sorry. Uh, UST Jet Screaming and Emergency Whistle. P38 Military Can Operator Opener Tool. Can Opener Tool. UST Emergency Candle. Cool. Sorry about the little delay. This would be traction folding knife. That's pretty cool. Dry stuff. Pour Instafire in a pile. Set Instafire pile on fire. Hey, look, you got a fire. There's a paracord. There's the whistle. Help me. I'm off the woods. There's the Mac V tool. Pretty neat. Batteries. The live fire thing. It's cool. Survival Guide. <coughs> oh, excuse me, sorry. Uh, survival Guide. I got a book like this before. Oh. Actually. Nothing in there. Yeah, I'll open up the batteries and put it in there. Put 
to Claris Batman flashlight. This is a car one. Oh, well, maybe that's the replacement for the Goal Zero flashlight, solar flashlight. Yeah, so that might be the replacement for it. Hmm. So, it's a little lantern and a flashlight. You can do either one. <coughs> Sorry, my allergies are acting up early this morning, and I forgot to take my allergy medicine. Using. I hope it's pretty securely. I mean, it'd be like those straps that we got in the. The spec out the skull bone on. Instead of using those metal hooks, you can use these plastic ones. Hook them on this stuff. Get two of them. We only really need two of them for a bag. Oh, yeah, this bag. Oh. Can opener. Bag from bag is from a technical Molly rucksack. So that's pretty cool. Wait, I just started my subscription too, and I was looking at the videos, somebody else's videos, and they said this is what you get when you first do it. Your your first um, survival box. So that's why I got. And I liked whatever else they got. So, <clears throat> I mean, it's such a nice, nice little bag. I think you probably do a lot with this. It's black too. So. Straps right here. So you can hook with these D rings, put them on this one, loop around your little backpack or something like that or a little sleeping bag or a little tent <coughs> yeah, not right now. or since you're, oh, if you're an airsoft not the greatest molly on the side Holds two. Uh, I don't have that on with me right now. It's in my truck, but the little, that little um, pouch that with the Molly, the green one from Stitch Profi or something like that. You put that on the side. That's pretty cool. Just got 
straps, is it straps off. Lock everything in place. This is a nice little item. Sorry. <coughs> we'll use this for like a little salt pack and push off. Female side of Volcar car right there. Nice little medical pouch. Put like your medical or, like, medical tools. Bleh. First aid. Sorry. First aid stuff in that one. It's pretty cool. Now I don't understand why like companies put in like. I mean I understand because you know little bright flashlights and stuff like that and everybody likes them, but you know. And like a survival a survival situation. I mean not all because, you know, bright bright lights are kinda abnormal in the woods, depending on what woods you live in. But um <clears throat> like if you don't if you're being like followed and tracked and stuff like that by people and you don't wanna get away and you wanna get keep away, like if all shit goes if all hell breaks loose and everybody's trying whatever and you wanna hide from like a disaster, you don't want a bright flashlight. You want a red light. <laughs> uh, you want something that helps with your night vision and help not be noticed. And nobody notices a red light. Air tank in that. I still have to have that. I haven't had my air tank. Let's see if this works. Alright, I have my air tank there. Right? Regular. Do the best? Probably not. No. It fits. There's not enough food in there. It's the second compartment. Or third, fourth compartment. No, third compartment. It's pretty cool. That's good. Now we have the main compartment. Zippers. Just checking on the zipper, making sure it wasn't broken. It wasn't getting zipped around. Let's see what is the inside. Protected pump, I guess. You can put your cell phone or your electronics on there so it won't get wet. Your keys, your money, your wallet. That's a cool little bag. I am trying to Yeah, that's what I got. Okay, so the reason why I got. The filler box is because, um, and if you wonder why I haven't done Airsoft GI stuff in a while, it's because they're shipping. Their shipping is horrendous. 
So if you watch, I'd get like five boxes. The shipping would be like 500 bucks, almost 500 bucks or 400 bucks. And you spend like 600 plus shipping. You're spending almost a thousand dollars just to get five mystery boxes that are a hundred bucks a piece. So if I was to go to sell everything in the box, yeah, I might in the boxes, I might make my money back or I'm only going to make maybe the shipping cost. So, you know, you spend 500 per box and you get guns that are 500 a piece. You're still short the shipping. And I think Airsoft GI needs to fix that because I'm in the U.S. And, you know, they use UPS. But shipping something that is, yeah, I just, I mean, maybe I'll buy one box or something like that instead of the five boxes. I think everybody would, I think that'd be more fun, but, you know, I like opening one or two. Because, you know, as you play Airsoft, guns go down, and we have a couple guns that go down, that went down that are repairable. So... You know, we got to replace those guns. But, um, <clears throat> but yeah, that's why you haven't seen any Airsoft GI mystery boxes this year, the last year, because the shipping cost is way too much for what it's worth. <laughs> you know what I mean? Unless you get, like, like I got the PS, PTS Masada, the gas blowback one, which is awesome. That's like a... That really expensive gun. Haven't got to use it yet, even though I shot it a few times just to check the uh, the FPS and whatnot. But yeah, it's just <laughs> so I get getting these these. Well, Spec Ops Global wasn't a filler box. I really like that box, and I see you know seen Unicorn Leia and a few other people get awesome stuff on that. So I decided to get on that. And I've only missed two February and Marches of this year. Uh, some crap with my card likes to... Yeah. You know how banks work with the security fraud. So that's why you haven't seen any of that. Or that's why you didn't see February and Marches. Which sucks because they had some really awesome gear that I was looking for. Or looking... That I missed out on. But, you know, we're going to get June's. We got May's, and we got January's. Three great box, or June and May. June, April, and May. Or January, April, April, and now we're getting... I got two boxes, right? Yeah, I got two boxes. I can't remember. Three. I think I got three. Yeah, I got three boxes. Um, May's wasn't too bad. I like maze. I don't like the lunchbox thing. <laughs> the, uh, yeah, that's funny. It's a lunchbox. Anyways, so, yeah, um, I'm working on doing the Airsoft GI stuff, or the mystery boxes. I just gotta find one that's cheaper shipping, so, <laughs> or just buy one Airsoft GI mystery box. But, uh, I'm gonna do more amped Airsoft mystery boxes because I like those. So stay tuned for Ampere Soft ones. Hopefully next one we'll get even cooler stuff as we did the last one. But uh, yeah, this has been Damnation and thanks for watching and hope you enjoyed this box opening. We got a bunch of cool fire starter stuff. And a knife and some can openers and flashlights. So yeah, so cool. Thanks for watching.